Hi and welcome to the next section. Now in this section what we're going to do is we're going to um, look at creating the images. So just as a recap what we've got here is we've got the image as one image and we've got the thin outline magenta outline. Alright just to show you that um, is what I've now created is a page 3 so you would uh, create another page but I've already done this so that um, I want you to bring in the images you want to use on a separate page so here you can see I've brought in an image and just to show you that usually when you have an image it will come with a white background so this is just to demonstrate uh, how it should come in you see it would have like a white border around it and what you want is you just want the edges now we've learned in in the previous lectures how to go around the edge of the image so I'm not going to waste too much time and I'm going to just do it very very quickly uh, just to I'm going to trace all with a bezier tool so again that's just to do it very quickly um, so that we've got uh, the the image of the bird and obviously you would go ahead and curve the edges and make it much more refined um, then once we've done that and we've um, power clipped the image inside I want you also to keep a separate um, example so in other words uh, once you've created it I want you to make a duplicate of it and just keep it to the side and make it uh, black as a silhouette and take away the outline and then power clip that image inside the effects power clip place inside so what you've got is uh, you've got the bird and you've got then the uh, silhouette of the bird now I'm going to be doing it quickly with all the other images as, as well just very quickly and then we're going to see how we can also uh, turn it into color uh, being aware that in this project there's a lot of green and blue. Okay, uh, so I'll see you in a second.